But I think that no, you have a dog face. That's what I was trying to say, like Tyra does. Aww, it's just a so roundabout cool. way to say it. <laughs> <laughs> that was really nice. Hey beauties and welcome to another video. If you're new here, my name is Erica, aka Glossy Boss, and welcome to my channel. So we're just starting off another vlog today, ladies and gents. And as you can see, I don't even know if you can notice. First of all, ignore my hair, y'all. I'm gonna use candy pecans from Trader Joe's. So yummy. I also put these in my salad. They were so good, like crunched out. Mmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. 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 Mm -hmm. Real quick, I just wanted to show y'all my glasses. So this was the first pair. So you can see they're green. It's like a cat eye shape. They're okay. I thought they were gonna be getting something else. And this was the replacement that I looked for to replace the ones I really liked. So, mm, they're okay. So, here is the second pair. These are literally very similar. They're what I'm used to. They're big. You see how they, they're like as wide as my face is? Like, these are not. I feel like all the other glasses that I have, they're not as wide as my face. Like, I like these because they're really big glasses. And I have um, a pair like these. My The other black pair that I wear that has the tortoise at the bottom, this is the same, the same except it's just all black. And I did the blue light blocking um, situation. So, these are okay. They're not like amazing but they're okay my hair it looks let me hear me get off this camera child Ooh, i'm getting like stressed out just looking at it no y'all i'm about to order a wig i'm about to order me a wig child okay so this is the third pair like i said these are these are okay they're safe they're just black so and they're the size i like these are too small for my face and i'm kind of irritated because i really like these oh they're not they're okay. These are, um, so they're like a clear, but they're like a nudish color. They're cute. They're cute. They're cute. They're cute. I like them. I like them. And then the last pair. Excuse me. I'll probably wear these for the rest of the day, actually. And I'm sorry. I didn't even explain. So when you get the glasses... They come in, so they come all packaged into the box I first showed you. But individually, they're in these drawstring bags that have the logo on it. And they're soft. And then the glasses are inside. I had already taken these out before. That's why they weren't put together like they, they're supposed to be. But they come with plastic on, you know, protecting the actual um, lenses. And then they're also wrapped in the cloth. So each pair that you buy will come with its own cloth. And your glasses do come protected. The lenses are protected. And then they're wrapped in the cloth. And then they're put inside of your bag. And so this is my next pair. I really want to show you guys the details. These are so cute. And they're red. Um, they're not like Sally, Jesse, Raphael red. But they're like, you know, different. These are really cute. These are real, real, real cute. I know these fit my face. I feel, I feel like kind of. Yeah, they're they're really light. They're super light. Like I feel like I'll, there's like I feel like I will break them. But these are cute. Oh, look, I just got electrocuted. <laughs> Maybe I need to just wash my hair and retwist it so it's all uniform. Cause like what? What is this? What do you call this? I don't know. Y'all. <laughs> I'm stressed out. <laughs> I'm stressed. I'm stressed, baby. I'm stressed. I'm stressed. Good morning, beauties. Is it even morning? Um, sorry. Yes. It's 11 o'clock. I'm doing a little bit better. Okay? I'm doing a little bit better. 
so my friend sent me this video on Instagram of this little oatmeal bake situation and I was like I have to make it y'all know I love oatmeal okay and I just had to make it so I got all my ingredients out and I was like oh I might as well just do it with y'all in case y'all wanted like a little snazzy take on um take on um oatmeal so I don't know what it's called, but basically you have like a little container. This is only, I'm only, I'm the only one who lives here, so this is my only baking dish. It's like, um, what is this? Like a seven by 11, basically. So small. So I take this and I'm going to take a banana and actually, let me just show y'all. Banana. Oh, this has bruises on it. I guess it doesn't matter, but still, I'm gonna take it off because I don't like boo boo bananas. And this banana, honestly, y'all, is probably not. I mean, all that there was no actual recipe, like, well, I mean, there was a recipe, but it just says one banana. But the bananas I get are kind of small, so basically, let me move all this stuff out of the way. So basically. They just took a fork and like mashed down the banana as the base, I guess. <laughs> this really is not big enough, I'm sure. But I'm trying not to make a whole bunch because it's just me and it's gonna go to waste. Because after about two days of eating this, I'm gonna be over it. <laughs> so you mash the banana. I'm just following what I saw in the video. And then we're gonna take some oats. Put that over it. Two shots of vodka. eyeballing all this. So we're gonna take some chia seeds. So we're gonna take some chia seeds. Probably just like basically take like two teaspoons. Really good source of fiber and fat. And then you guys, when I went to the Whole Foods last time, I went to Whole Foods with y'all. Um, actually the time before the last time. <laughs> so this has been my refrigerator for a long time, but I haven't opened it yet. Um, so I have seen this video on TikTok and they were just talking about like almond milks and how a lot of the almond milk that we use like I don't know the regular brands like the store-bought brand or like silk or what have you if you look at the ingredients they have a lot of like gums and like a whole bunch of like binders and everything but almonds I don't even think I see almonds in the list of ingredients so they were showing like what are some brands that just use straight just regular natural ingredients and I believe this was one of the brands. So when I saw it in Whole Foods on um, that time, I was like, oh, I wanna try it. So it's called Almond Milk. And this particular one is, van is vanilla flavored. The one that was just regular um, uh, only had three ingredients, this has five. So it's non-GMO and the five ingredients are, the ingredients are just filtered water, organic almond butter, um, and the, re the one that has three ingredients is just filtered water, almond butter, and Himalayan pink salt. This one, since it's vanilla flavored, it's those three plus organic natural flavors and organic vanilla uh, extract. So no gums, no dairy, no fillers, no binders, no gluten, no carrageenan. I don't even know what that is, but I'm glad it doesn't have it. So we're gonna try This is my first time trying it. Um, it smells good. You guys, it really just smells like almonds. So they say just put enough just to cover it. Not a lot. So, and then mix it up. Mix it up. Okay, okay, this might be a little bit too much. <laughs> probably is a little bit too much. I'm gonna add a little bit more oatmeal, y'all, because I think I added too much. And honestly, I probably need more, uh, I 
probably need more uh, banana. But I really don't want to add another banana in there. So here's your oats. Y'all saw what I did. Y'all saw what I did. I hope you have more banana. And then I'm going to take a berry medley from Trader Joe's. It just has berries. Strawberries, blackberries, blueberries, raspberries. Heating on 355. So once I'm done this, I'm just going to stick it in the oven for 25 minutes. And then you'll see what I do after that. This has a lot of water in it. That's kind of annoying. This big old giant strawberry. So I'm just gonna sprinkle a little bit of coconut on top. This is gonna be so good. <laughs> so here is the product. So we have, like I said, we mashed up the banana on the bottom, then we added the oats on top, sprinkled in some chia seeds, added our almond milk, went ahead and added the frozen fruit on top, and then lastly, coconut. And like I said, I'm gonna put this in the oven on 355 for about 25 minutes. So after it's done cooking, then I'll okay, be back. So I finished cooking it. This is what it looks like. I put some in a bowl. I just cooked oatmeal. <laughs> so now what we're gonna do, what I'm gonna do is take some yogurt, some plain Greek yogurt. I love Greek yogurt. I prefer, I'm sorry, let me not say I love Greek yogurt. I prefer Greek yogurt over regular yogurt. I'm just gonna take a big heaping scoop, put it on top, there we go. And then we're going to take some honey. And just drizzle it on top. And here we go. Okay, sorry y'all. I'm watching Bel Air. Do y'all watch Bel Air? It's so good. I like it better than the show. Okay. You know what? I'm actually just gonna add a little bit of cinnamon to the top. Just a little bit. Okay. Okay, so now we're gonna try it. I hope it's good, y'all. Wow. I don't know what I was expecting. Oops. Wow, that's really good. I wish I had a bigger banana because the pieces that I'm getting banana in are just like blowing my mind. Make this. Hey, beauties. <laughs> Happy Friday. Happy Friday. I had a long day. A long day, okay. I went into work, I go into work every Friday now. I don't know if I told y'all, so I'm about to cook me some dinner and chill out for the rest of the night. I'm looking forward to that, but real quick, I just wanted to show y'all. So, y'all see my hair, child, looking. I bought a wig <laughs> from Beauty Forever. Well, it's not really from Beauty Forever, it's the brand Beauty Forever, and I actually just bought this from Amazon. Amazon Prime, baby. Got this thing in two days. Really one day. So it came in this box. Like I said, I'm rambling, child. So I'm here. Yeah, it came in this box. And that's so sweet. They actually gave me lashes. These are so long. They gave me lashes. They gave me a wig cap. And they gave me a headband. I think this is. I'm not sure. How they know I'm a leopard? How they know? 
Um, so let's open up the here. So it comes in this plastic bag. Now this is supposed to be 24 inches, child. I'm gonna wash it tonight because I'm putting it on tomorrow because mama got plans. It's really pretty. Oh wow, it's really pretty. Um, I'm not getting any shedding as I run my fingers through it. I did get it in a 1B. It's kind of real 1B-ish. Um, this doesn't really look like 24 inches, but it might be. It might be. So anyway, here's the part you just cut these laces. And this is the U part, so it has combs. So it has two combs in the front, a comb in the back. Um, like So like the, both sides of your, your leave out and then the, the back of your leave out. And then underneath it has combs at the bottom. Oh, you're supposed to be able to put this in a ponytail. That's interesting. Okay, that's interesting. Yeah, you're supposed to be put this in a ponytail, but we're not doing this. And it has straps, so you can make it smaller or bigger, depending on your head size. So I'm excited. So I'm gonna wash this tonight, and then tomorrow I'll show you guys. I'll show you guys me actually applying it. That's gonna be a whole another monster child, because I don't know nothing about this life, and I really kind of want to. I don't know. My sister has my flat iron. Yeah, it's not shedding, so it's pretty. I think. <laughs> I think. And then I wanted to show you guys some new candles I got. Oops. So I've mentioned my friend's um home goods company on here before. I think my very first video and then other videos, but um, she, her latest collection was the Cozy Collection, if I'm not mistaken. And these came out a while ago, but I, um, never ordered any. So I finally ordered some, so she sent to me. So this is the box. This is her, her, she's packaging queen. Okay. She's going to have a presentation. And I just feel like that's so important for people's brands. Like, that's your reputation. Packaging means a lot. So, um, I love, she's very much a person who's very uh, detail oriented. So I know, see that. And just because I know her, I know that, but like, I see that if I, even if I didn't know her, I could tell from her packaging. So when you open it, so when you open it, you have, she has like little cards here. Thank you cards. I love when businesses do that. Um, another card talks about the candle care. You guys. Oh, this is so beautiful. I need to take a picture of this before I even touch it. Wow, this is... She put leaves in here, guys. This is a collection that... Wow, this collection came out like, like months ago, y'all. So, like, during the, the, the fall time. Wow, this is so pretty. Okay, so we get past the leaves. This is so cute. I'm trying not to take out all this stuff. This is so pretty so I, I got a uh, room spray so she does room sprays and I got a couple of candles I got three candles so here's the packaging they come in these bags that are definitely reusable I use these when I travel um I put um I have one I put my fragrances in I have one I put my jewelry in so I really love these bags and I love that this can be these can be repurposed so in the bag is the first candle this is called boyfriend's hoodie this vessel is so heavy Okay, it smells so good. Mmm, this smells so good. It's the notes are fresh air, green leaves, white musk, I believe. Mmm, this smells like fall. Like I wish I would have ordered them when she actually um, had the collection come out. But these are beautiful. This is absolutely beautiful, and it smells the cold throw. Smells so good. This is so heavy, y'all. And these are 14 ounce candles. So pretty, super, super pretty. Um, the second one I got, there's another bag. As you guys can see, let me open it up. Um, let me hurry from this one, child. The first of all, the colors. This one's called Nightfall, Oud Patchouli, and Resins. Those are the, the, the notes. Mm. Oh my gosh, y'all. <laughs> wow. It's called Nightfall. I like this chocolate vessel. This is so beautiful. 
Mmm, so beautiful. Oh, I'm so excited. I have new candles. Because I was running out of candles, y'all. Oh. And then the last one. This one was, oh, Memory Lane. I love, this is from a past um, collection she did. This candle smells so good. It's lavender and chamomile. Mmm. I'm not a big lavender fan, but the mixture of lavender and chamomile, it warm, the chamomile, I guess, warms it up. So it's like a warm lavender. I love it. I love it. Ooh, ooh. I have to call her child. These candles smell so good. So you guys definitely check her out. Her um, company is Less & Co. I'll leave um, the name here on Instagram right here. And then a link to her um, website will be in the description box below. You guys definitely go check her out and follow her. She has a new collection coming out soon that you guys are not going to want to miss. Um, and it's, it's being released next week. So definitely go ahead and follow her so you can stay update, updated with all of her, um, you know, news and just visit her site and see it for yourself, child. So definitely you guys check that out. Like I said, I'm about to wash this wig. I'm about to make me some dinner. And I'm about to chill out for the rest of this Friday. So I will catch you guys tomorrow because we'll try this wig situation out. <laughs> I'm going to twist up my hair tonight because I don't know how to cornrow. I know. I know. I'm a black girl that don't know how to cornrow. I don't know how to cornrow. So I'm going to twist up something serious and then we'll do all that tomorrow. I might run some errands too, but I don't know. I have plans in the evening. So we'll see. We'll just see how the day goes. It's the next day. Okay. And I'm about to try to figure out this wig. I kind of feel like I really should not have done this. So right, right before going somewhere. Because I really don't know what I'm doing. But we just gonna make it do what it do. Um Hair in a while, and this is the only hair that came out. 
Now for me, this is not a lot of hair. I don't know about y'all, but um, yeah, I love this brush because it detangles and it doesn't pull out all my hair. So for not brushing my hair for a couple days, this little bit of hair is literally nothing. So I love this brush. If I can remember where I got, well, this is the company, here you go. Cosmo Lage, Cos I don't know how to pronounce it. But this is the company, and if I can find a link, if I remember, I'll put it down below. Um, but yeah, so this is my little bit of leave out, child. I don't know what this is. I don't know what this is, child. And hopefully, this is enough space for the U part. So two little um, pigtails, and I'm literally just gonna smooth, like, pull this over this way, and bobby pin it, like, twist it around this hair tie, and. Bobby pin it or pin it, and then I'm gonna do the same thing with this side. So I'm gonna put the one in the back end, and then this one, and that's that, y'all. Wow, that was pretty easy. Wait, hold on, hold on, y'all. I think it would be easier if I had, um, if it had, um, clips, but this just has the combs. Oh, oh, I'm hot already. Oh, okay, okay. Um, <laughs> oh, it's hot, y'all. Okay, so we're gonna. So yeah, I put, well, I should have took the lace of the back off where I cut it off, I didn't. Okay, so I made it a little bit tighter. It feels more secure. It feels more secure. So now I'm going to have my leave out. I'm gonna take this here, get it out my face. Oh, I'm so hot, y'all. Oh, I'm so hot. Y'all, so I decided to not curl it because I don't really have time to sit here and do that. Maybe I'll do that tomorrow. This wig, it's like there's something loose about it in the middle of my head. I have to figure it out, but I just don't have time today. So I just, like you guys, I just straightened um, my leave out. So mad I didn't have protectant. Yeah, my wig is like super loose. Like super loose. Like this, this wig is huge. So, yeah, I gotta figure it out. But anyway, the hair is really pretty. Really, really, really pretty. And um, I'm about to just go finish getting ready. So, I may come back um, before I leave. I don't even know if I'm gonna vlog going out or not. So, either you'll see me later tonight or you'll see me tomorrow.